Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I have my office shirt on today. I'm feeling super festive. Um, I just wanted to share with you some of my favorite coffee products because this channel is mostly for, you know, product comparisons and vegan food and things like that. But um, you know, and if you don't know, you'll find out that I love coffee, everything coffee. I drink coffee every day. I recently purchased an espresso machine this year and a coffee grinder and a scale and everything <laughs> that just went along like with this obsession. Um, you know, 2020 has been hard and I needed to treat myself and it was something that I scoured the internet for, for years because I had thought about buying an espresso machine and like having this be a part of my daily routine forever and I finally did it and I just wanted to share with you like how I make my coffee every day and like maybe help you find something new in your life that you're excited about and a new product that can bring you some joy during this holiday season, during this time of like wild uncertainty and just wackiness. And you know, I, I know that my brain has been all over the place and <sighs> coffee probably doesn't help that, but in a way it also helps me feel better. I don't know. So today I'm gonna share with you my Cuisinart coffee grinder and my Revel Duo Temp Pro espresso machine. Um, I am cheap. I don't like to spend a lot of money on myself or on things that I don't necessarily need all the time. Um, so I do a lot of research to find the product that's like somewhat affordable but still feels like a treat myself kind of moment, but then something that is uncomplicated, intuitive, somewhat simple, um, that I don't have to like do a whole lot of research for to figure out how to use. And something that kind of just like is a really good balance of all of those things and can fit into my life with really without too much like complication. Um, that being said, these machines are wonderful. I will get to showing you them quite soon. Um, the Cuisinart is, I, I believe, sixty dollars. Um, I think that's what I paid for it. It is one of the highly, most highly rated machines on Amazon and Wayfair and all those websites that, you know, we go to to purchase such things. And then the Breville Duo Temp is kind of like the mid-level espresso machine by Breville. And Breville is a name that everybody knows. It's super popular. Lots of great reviews and. You know, it's the thing that really fit the bill for me. So let's move on so I can show you those. Okay, so this is the Cuisinart grinder. As you can see, it has beans in it already because it is constantly in use in my house. Um, it smells so good. And I use, um, like I said in my previous video, Equal Exchange Coffee because it's fair trade. It's really delicious. It's just awesome. Um, I have the Black Silk Espresso kind brand, I don't know, in here. Um, and you just fill, this is called the hopper. You fill the hopper almost all the way. Nice little top that goes on. And it has all these different settings on it. So it has, mine's a little dusty, has fine, medium, coarse. I set mine to the fifth dot for espresso. Um, and for a regular drip co coffee, I go more towards the medium middle of the um, road there. And then it has four, eight, 12, and what's that last one? 18. So that's uh, talking about the different cups of coffee. So if you are making like only four cups of coffee, which is what, like half a pot, um, you set it to four. If you're making more, you set it to, you know, the higher gauge. Um, it's really simple, really intuitive to use. Um, I didn't even have to like read the instructions for it, although I should have, but I didn't need to. So, and then you just have this start button here, which you press. It is kind of loud, but I feel like all coffee grinders are loud because it's a coffee grinder um, and it's the conical burr so the mechanism inside of it is like a cone shape and then it has like these burrs on it that grind the coffee as it goes down into this container here super easy to pull off mine has some coffee in it from this morning um, really easy to clean not a huge like machine either it fits really nicely in my kitchen um, we're under a home renovation right now which is why you see like these insanely white walls and like molding gone and all kinds of craziness behind me. Um, but it fits really, really well into my kitchen. It is so like unobtrusive, like it, it's just perfect. It really works well for me. And for the price, something relatively affordable, um, 
it really just works the best. So I absolutely recommend this. And a little bit later on, I'm going to show you how I use it to make my morning espresso. But now for the espresso machine. Okay, so this is my beautiful Breville Duo Temp Pro. Um, it fits nicely in my kitchen. It's not too large. Please excuse the red walls. We're working on it. It comes with this porta filter and a few removable um, different options for uh, pressurized and non pressurized porta filter um, filters, I guess. It comes with your milk mug, perfect, works awesome with oat milk and other um, plant based milks. You have your steam wand which works amazingly. I absolutely love it. You have your water catch under here, which then pulls out your storage tray. And we have all these different quarter filter filters that it comes with for different pressurized and different sized espresso shots. You have your, um, I'm not exactly sure what this is called. It's like a, yeah, the razor. So it helps you like trim off your excess grounds on your porta filter but I never really use that because it seems pretty pretty intuitive either way you just need to empty this occasionally when there's too much water in it you have your tamp which is magnetic goes right up there and as you can see it is super super simple you have the power you have espresso and milk and you have the two different options so steam and hot water so you can also do a cup of um hot tea with this also you could just use it for hot water which is really awesome and then this whole tray up here is heated so when you turn it on it starts to warm your espresso cups which i think is just a really like luxurious kind of feature and then in the back you have your water which you know you can refill really easily and the filters back there also um it's just a really great machine my husband thinks that it sounds like an airplane when you turn it on and when it starts to brew your coffee um i don't know it's just a really nice humming sound it's not extremely loud but it is not quiet either so if you're really sensitive to noises like that or somebody in your house is really sensitive like and you want to make something while they're sleeping i don't know you might have to consider them a little bit but it's it's not extremely loud it's just not it's not very quiet either but that's okay i mean i think most espresso machines are you know a little noisy but that's okay um once it is warmed up both lights will come on and you can choose steam or hot water it's on steam right now because you know that's the one i typically use um, but then when you're ready to brew your coffee you just insert this into your machine and then you press or you turn the dial left and then you control your shot pretty manually. It's really awesome um, a machine I absolutely recommend. And it is typically under $400, usually between three and 350, depending on the sale, which I know isn't like cheap, but it's worth it. It produces really high quality coffee and there are, you know, some espresso machines out there that are thousands of dollars. And this one was really something that I felt was affordable enough, but still, indulgent enough that it could be like a treat myself kind of gift and I use it every day instead of spending five to seven dollars on a latte you know at my place of work so win 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 another really important gadget for my coffee making in the morning is this small pocket-sized AWS scale um, I think it's really for anything where you need to measure 0.01 or to the point of one grams. Um, it's super precise, really easy to use. It has this little push outside that you use to turn it on. And it has different modes too, so you can use ounces, you can do grams, uh, and it is just awesome. I use it every single day, I've had it for months. Um, absolutely no complaints for me. It was super, super affordable and just a really, really nice product. It works absolutely perfectly for coffee and espresso and you know also if you want to weigh out like some spices or you need something that's like for a small recipe and you only need a couple grams like it's really really excellent for really small precise measurements so i would absolutely recommend getting a scale for your espresso it definitely helps all right i'm going to show you these products in action now and the way that i make my coffee just about every single day we're going to use our grinder set it to the fifth dot like i talked about before 
and we're going to look for a grind that is fine but not powdery. You don't want it to stick to your fingers when you take it out of the machine. It has to have enough body to it to stand on its own. Perfect. And then we are going to measure it out on our scale that I just talked about. So perfect. I just use like any random receptacle, but I've been using this plastic cup to try to, you know, reduce my waist. And I usually measure out about 13 grams. That works best for me. I add it to my portafilter, trying carefully not to spill any grinds anywhere. And I gently press it down with my fingers just to even it out so that the tamping mechanism has an easier time and then you kind of push it in and turn it with an even strength you don't want it too hard you don't want it too soft you want a nice medium strength and then i add oat milk to a small glass with a little bit of maple syrup and i stick that in the microwave i could foam it but i'm just not really a, a big fan of like super foamed milk and i like mine just kind of heated through so that i can brew my espresso right into it Once you are ready, you turn that dial to the left and you watch your coffee brew. It is absolutely beautiful to watch. I just love this whole process and this whole ritual of making coffee. And if you guys are interested, links to the espresso machine, the grinder, and the scale are all in the description space so that you can purchase these products for your own or you can start your research pro process. Whatever works best for you, I'm here for you. And these are the products that I use and love every single day. And then you have this beautiful multi-layered cup of espresso and it is just gorgeous and indulgent and just an incredible way to start your morning. I absolutely recommend these products. They're perfect. I've had them for almost a year now and I just love them. So enjoy guys. Please subscribe to this channel and like this video and I hope to see you soon. Bye for now.